Hello, my name is Rick Orsini, and this is Steve Olson, and we work for the LAP Group. The LAP Group manufactures wire and cable, connectors, and strain relief products. And this year at the show, there are a couple of great and exciting things that we want to talk about regarding product innovations and standards. One of the main points that we're talking about here at the show this year is the changes to the codes. NFP 79 2007 came out in January, and uh, that basically discussed changes to cabling for machinery. In 2008, the NEC code was adopted, and what you see here is a map of adoption by state for the 2008 NEC code. The green states represent states that have already in compliance or plan to be in compliance by year end. The yellow states are states that are in the process of updating their standards and hope to be compliant by 2009 or 2010. The pink states are states that have their own local adoption, meaning that in different parts of that state they could be using the up-to-date 2008 standards or they might be using old standards or different standards for that jurisdiction. And the red states are states that are still working off 2005 NEC code. The NFPA 79 standard basically is for machine wiring. The 2008 NEC standard is basically for plant wiring. In the NEC 2008, when it comes to machine wiring, they do support the NFPA 79 2007 standard. So what we're basically talking about here with all our machine builders is to make them aware of the changes to the standards and how it affects them and the cables that they use on their machinery. This map is accurate as of September 8, 2008.